305. We may as well do it. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Jurassic World, the game. It has been a long time coming, and you guys have been constantly requesting it. Like, what, wait, what, what happened to Jurassic World, the game? What happened to Jurassic World Life? What, what do you even do anymore? <laughs> but I thought since we've just got a recent update in the uh, lagoon area, that is, of Jurassic World Evolution 2, as we got the Dunkelostius, the Nothosaurus, the Shonisaurus, and the Archelon, I thought, well, what else is Jurassic that also has aquatic creatures? Jurassic World, the game, of course. So there we go. 305 was my max amount I could get for this. And I actually got 390 mid. Yeah! <laughs> and there we go, 10 DNA. So, now this, the reason why I'm making this video is because I spotted something in the game. And it's always a good time when we get to go back to Jurassic World again. I do want to, I feel like I want to change the park. And I've said this for years now. But it, it's all about the coin and, you know, when you can trade it for good stuff. So what, what's the point? <laughs> I might as well just keep it all like that. Maybe Site B should be something different. Maybe we should do something here. Um... But I also do have all of these statues that I need to keep out. Because if I put them in my reserve, then when I do trades, there'll be a potential waste to trade there. Which will be like trade the Alpha Omega statue for coin. When I don't want to trade it for coin. It's stupid. Um, so yeah, we do have this. This is a recent one with a beautiful, the 30th anniversary uh, logo there, the T-Rex as well, which is basically, I think, the T-Rex from Jurassic World Alive, or maybe even Rexy from this game, that would make more sense, uh, as opposed to this one, which is just the T-Rex, the 25th anniversary, five years ago, we got that one, good god, that's been in here for ages, I think, or it says JP25, so I'm assuming that is, eight year anniversary of Jurassic World? Possibly. Could be the game as well, because they both came out at the same time. We've got some lovely uh, decoration with the Mosasaur there. Not so great. But I do like the T-Rex and the Indominus Rex one. Um, but the reason why I'm making this video is because I came into here and I saw this offer, Monsters of the Deep. So it was originally 160,000 bucks, which is... Of course, ludicrous. That's, that's why they've crossed it out and said 90% off, because no one would have spent that. But... For 15,000, you can get the uh, Plesiosuchus max level, level 40, no boosting needed at all for it. And on the surface, it seems really good. I saw this, I clicked on it and went, well, we've got to do that. That's an amazing offer. But actually, I already have this guy. So this was a tournament creature. I, I think it was, I think it's a tournament creature. Because uh, if we go into my market, we go into aquatic, we filter by things I don't have. We go here, we have the Suchitotus, the Gorna, go, the, the Gonorrhosaurus, <laughs> whatever this is, the Temonodontosaurus. We go down, ah, uh, that's a point. Yeah, these are things that I don't have. So these, these are things I don't have at the moment. There is some money off, which again, for the next eight hours, you, VIP exclusive surface creatures 30% off. Oh, I don't know if it is a surface. It might be, okay. But where is it? Hold on, hold on. I had I had it. Is it it's not down here, is it? Okay, hold on. You got the Gilicus, the Platyceropus, the Bonogamus, the Romulio, um, and oh! Maybe I don't have it. I so thought I did. Archlon, Mosasaur, Thalmasaur, U Moon. So we've got the Gorno, the Tem. There it is. Sorry, I do have it. I just don't have any ready to hatch. So it's not a surface. So there's no point in the offer. There you go, unfortunately. 60% off. But I do have it. Now, if we spend the 15,000, which is actually more than 90% off the offer, um, you don't spend any DNA. But if you look quite closely up there, I have 900,000. We almost are back to a million. I have been playing this in my own spare time. Um, and... Not only that, when you think about it, we've got the four free hatches. So already, I think if we click on this, we go instant hatch. So it's still 250 bucks. That's way better than 15,000 bucks. <laughs> so we go in here, we click on it, and we've already got one level 20. I didn't even notice we already had one level 20. 
so we can feed it. So that is three already down. We're going to have four. Well, two already down. Four, so six. So really, we only have to speed up two to get this to level 40. So we'll go in here. Oh, we got another one. We got another when Grady needs a hand. Let's just evolve this. Instant fuse as well. So we're not spending any books. And DNA is something that I'm more than happy to spend on. That's awful. How dare you? On a Fukuiasaurus? What a waste of time. Uh, <laughs> go to the market. Go aquatic. Uh, actually, yeah. Maybe it was probably better going the other way, actually. Yes. Where is it? New moon. Ple Pleosuture. So, 900 attack. 4,321. Uh, we'll get you another instant hatch. Boom. Bada bing. That's not what I meant to do. We do have this if I want to, but I think we've already got a Margasol maxed up. I'm pretty sure. Do another one. Instant hatch. Boom. Done. Uh, so, that is another 20. Then, So, that's three 20s. Only two more. So I could have spent 15,000 uh, bucks. At the moment, I've only spent 1,000, I think. It's 250 to speed it up each time. So let's see how much one costs to speed up instantly. Now, where is it? Ah, there it is. No, that's not it. Oh, it's in the free one. 1,600. Okay, so when we put that together, so far, 1,000... Oh, sorry. 2,700 bucks. And the final one that we need, I'm pretty sure, there it is. 1,000, so 3,200, 4,200 in order to get this, um, maxed up. What a waste. <laughs> well, it's not really a waste, but it's a, it's a waste when you consider the alternative, which would have been 15,000. That's the waste. Yes, yum, 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 yum. Stun the fish, yeah. How can we not forget? This is where it all started, where we got the lagoons to start with, the lagoons, the glacier. I really feel that Jurassic World Evolution 2 is probably going to introduce glacier creatures. That would be so cool. We'll evolve. We'll instant fuse these. I could save this for something else, but I'm there's no real need to. Um, so that's a level 30. Okay, so we need... Oh, yeah, we've fused these guys. I What I could do, I suppose, is save my fuses for something good. But at the moment, there's nothing I really need to use it for. So we'll feed you... Get you up to level 20, and then you up to level 30. We'll have a look at what its evolution looks like when it does get to level 30. And also, we're going to get some books, some VIP stuff back as well, because, of course, when you get them to another level, you unlock the facts, and the facts look different. So we've got, like, a little pinky look to it so far. Oh, there we go. 100 books. That's good. Okay, we're making some back, and... Okay. Hey, look at this. Now, guys, if you haven't already, uh, this video is going up uh, oh god <gasps> well this video the previous one to it i did on the japanese giant salamander and there was so many people that commented on that video about it being kool-aid or super kool-aid you know a, an amphibian that we've covered in, in this not was it from this game but it's not from just a pop build. It might be from just a pop build, but I think mainly it's from this one. Um, so if you haven't had the chance to check it out, do... If you've got a spare second, um, which I was trying to... Me and Richard, and just generally the whole purpose of the video, was to try and raise awareness of the situation that the... You know, these real-life creatures are facing. Things that have existed for 20 million years and really need our help. Either to spread awareness, share the video, um... Or you can also donate and help out that way if you have the, the funds necessary. Um, it's, of course, not at all uh, required, but just the fact, you know, it's all about educating. And that is the main purpose of that video. I took that video on myself because I wanted to... I, I had a vision for it. I knew I wanted the, the video to come across a certain way. And, you know... I, I wanted to have full control of that one. Normally, with the IRL videos, I might hand it off to an editor. Very rarely I do, but uh, like the Godzilla Island, I did that myself. Most uh, most things on the channel I do myself. But in order to keep content going out, I, I need to offload some of that. But with that one, I knew it was special and I needed to focus with that. Uh, so we'll jump back into here. So we've got a level 30. We'll instant fuse saving really the most amount of books we would save is the final evolution because that's the one that's going to take up the most chances and also cost the most books um there is also a new vip event uh going on right now as well as the kraken is also by the like baku lights 
is also in the game at the moment. So we'll evolve this instant fuse, 180 bucks. There it is, done first time in the creation lab. The uh, final level 32 or 31, 240, please you suit us. Right, let's speed you, we're getting to level 39. So we can at least watch the animation twice. All the way through, looking glorious. So it's red, lost kind of the stripes and also the pink. I love the, the glow from the underside. Lighting in this game can look really good. It's just a shame that we don't really get to see it too often because I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know why. Especially when it comes to the battle arenas, they just decide, nah, we're gonna show you the same boring one over and over again. But the aquatic arena and the aquatic lighting, oh, no, no sound on that one, that's interesting, always looks amazing in here. Um, oh yes, look at you. So now we finally get the 100 bucks. Uh, please so just had large ridged rectangle sharpened teeth. These teeth in combination with a powerful jawbone made chewing through thick material quite easy. Now you might be thinking, oh, so that's all we're getting? No, no, we have, if we go into the claim, uh, is there anything in here? No, okay, well we can go in here. We've got the Coral Crusader pack, but this is the new thing. I think it's a surface, is it? No, it's a reef, of course, because all the reefs have the, uh, like, Chronosaur animation set. Now, if we upgrade, now, I never normally do this. If we upgrade to the Grand Premium Bundle, uh, we get 2,500 of the points. We instantly unlock it. And it's weird because in the market, it says that this is an amber dinosaur, even though it's a tournament creature. So I don't know what's going on there. We get an extra incubator. We get an extra canister to fuse things. Um, and as well as some packs. I mean, that's all we get now. Apparently, we're going to get these ones as well. I think this is all the, the stuff that you eventually you unlock generally um, with the next pass. So you could get loads more. So hold on, yeah, buds. We're going to spend. I haven't spent money in this game in years, I think. Yeah, good God. Anyway, it's for the content. It's a tax write-off. <laughs> yes, grand premium. You now have access to the premium pass. 2,500 of that. The Goronyosaurus. Goronyosaurus. Oh, okay. The Coral Crusader, which had... Oh my God, no way. Oh, hold on. Oh, I just cleared the, the sound effect. Damn. Oh, there we go. <laughs> That'll do. We actually unlocked. What were the chances of actually unlocking it? In that one. Already at level 20, we can make with that. That's kind of crazy. Well, I want to know what the chances of getting that were. The extra incubator, the extra canister, mammoth diorama. Okay, cool, cool, cool. As well as, whoa, look at Blue Go unlocking all of the prizes. Yes. Now, we should have unlocked the Coral Crusader pack somewhere. So, okay, what were the chances? 5% chance we were going to unlock that. Also, the Platyceropus, we could have unlocked as well. Or like, you know, we had a chance of getting that. So, very low. 5% chance of getting that. We actually did. That's kind of crazy. <laughs> we also have a Megalodon level 1 if we want to. See, this game has Megalodon. Jurassic World Evolution 2 doesn't. So, we're going to go back into here. Uh, so, we can get... Oh, it still cost DNA to get it. Oh, that's kind of sucky. All right, so we're going to go you. We're going to scroll to the end. There it is, Gorgonosaurus. Now, I will spend some bucks to just unlock this. We can fuse it for free. There it is. It kind of looks very similar to Chronosaurus. Yeah, we'll have a... Give it a quick feed. Let's see. How does it look? Oh, look at the fishy. Oh, it looks awesome, man. I love it. They put so much effort into the animations of these guys. They really did. This is back when, you know, Jurassic World the game was the biggest, baddest, newest thing. Um, and then we have Jurassic World Live now, which I'm assuming in comparison is churning out massive profit in comparison to this game for Ludia. Uh, so we'll get it to level 10. It's exactly like a Chronosaur, actually. It is all attack and not health. Its attack is basically the same as its health. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so we should be able to get another one. There it is. We'll hatch you. All of my thousands of bookaroos. And we'll get you to level 10. We'll do an instant fuse because why not? Always. I, I always forget. I should just fuse anything. Just start using them so the timer goes. Because if you don't use them, you're, you're basically just losing the time because it takes a week for them to refresh. So here we go at level 20. 
There it is. Yeah, I think it was about 450 health and 400 attack at level 10. So at level 20, 768 health and 720 attack. Still pretty decent. Uh, Goron Yosaurus is a marine lizard that belongs in the Mosasaur family. Belongs? Or oh, belongs to? <laughs> Never mind. My dyslexia. Uh, a small Mosasaur. It was a Mosasaur. A uh, Goronosaurus could reach a length of 5.15 meters or 17 feet around the length of a large female great white shark. Because the males are either smaller or bigger. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, okay. Well, we have that guy now. No, 25. Oh, come on. I don't have time for that. So, complete the daily challenges. Fuse 8 amphibians, fuse 55 amphibians. I really want to just try and unlock as much of this stuff as I can. Now that I've paid real money for it, we can... Let's have a look. I mean, we'll not count maybe getting it from this pack, because that was super rare. Um, like, really rare of getting that. That's never happened to me before. Uh, so, if we do this... So far, we got a level 30, because that's 4 there. And then if we keep on going... Let's see how many more we unlock. We unlock another one. So that's a level 30 and a level 10. Another one. Another one. So that's a level 30 and a level 20. And another one. So it's a 30, a 20, and a 10. Now, if we manage to get one more from the packs, we could get a level 40. I think. Oh, no. Yes. Yes, we could. Because 30, level 20, level 10, then two 20s, two... Yep. And then that makes it 32, 30. So there's a chance if we pull one more from the 5% chance packs, we could actually get a level 40. And I think we, you know, we have one more pack. So if we can pull it right this second, now it's very rare. We got, you don't understand how lucky we got with that pull there. We have one pack. Do we have another one or is that it? That's it for now. Okay, so we're going to try that. Come on. Come on. Pray. I pray. Please give me the another Goronosaurus now. Oh, uh, damn it. Didn't get it. <laughs> oh, well, we got Nunda Sutures. Anyway, that is not only all I wanted to showcase, because we need to use them. We need to see them in action. Um, so let's have a look. I've got, also got missions, so... We've got a whole bunch of that to get. That's good. Never really collect that. Um, now, the event is locked, so we didn't get the prize for the Kraken. Um, but we can still participate in it. And that's the most important part. Because you get lots of... You get thousands of DNA for doing this. Also, we've got this as well. The World, World Social Event Facebook? They're still trying to get followers on Facebook. I have no idea why. Why is that... Like, wait, what? Breakthrough pack? Interesting. Okay, a couple of thousand and a Tyranna Titan. As well as... Ooh, some juicy... Friggin' juicy VIP points there. Uh, so I still have this mission, but who cares? All I'm getting is 24,000 food. I mean, maybe there's more... You know, I, I you probably could check it online what all the missions are, I suppose. But there's also this, the Kraken 18. The Kraken 18 is gaining its strength. The community goal has been extended to allow all users to participate. So, I don't know what that's going on about. Uh, so, okay. I just got 1,500 free VIP points. I'm not going to say no to that. But, what I thought was interesting, I never noticed this. There is an offer of this. So, you get 35% off. What do you get for it? Well, you have a chance of getting a woolly mammoth, a mosasaur, a uteranus, an indominus rex, there's more chance of us getting a Mosasaur than the other pack. Um, but there's more chance of us, oh, of course, getting the rare uh, legendary. But you do get some of that. Now, there is other packs to win, but you don't know what you, they are, how much they cost, until you unlock the first one. And the first one does cost five, sorry, 2,535 bucks. Now, I am tempted to do this because I've never seen it before. Now, if the next pack is even cheaper... I might keep going and do this all. However, if it's the same price and it's or it goes higher, I won't. Because they're like that's 2016, 17, 18. Now in 18, there's 32% chance of getting a super rare, which basically I'm spending thousands of bucks to get that. And the rest of the prizes aren't that great. So what I will do is just have a check, because maybe after I spend 2,000 bucks, the rest will be cheaper. 
I highly doubt it, but here we go. 2,500 bucks. An absolute waste. But let's see. We got a T-Rex. Okay. I mean, not one of the worst ones, I suppose. We can sell it. Uh, so let's see. Okay, so the next one is also 2,300. It's 5% extra off. But I'm pretty sure... But that's around about the same price. <laughs> the last one's 35%. This is 40%. But honestly, it's not making much of a difference. And we have a 2% chance of getting the Metrophodon. And only a 39% chance of getting the Marsupialion. And I'm not willing to spend more thousands upon thousands of bucks. Especially when, if we scroll along to the right... There's actually some decent rewards here. For 2,500 bucks, we have the VIP exclusive pack, which is the Strike Team Firebolt EX. Now, th there's no good dinosaurs here. However, the real reward is in the DNA. You could get 7,500 DNA, which is quite a lot. I mean, I would, I would trade 7,500 DNA for 2,500 bucks. But the other way around, no, I wouldn't do it. But it is there, and if you do want some of those, the Fidelity exclusive, which I don't have, is actually worse. It only gives you 500, but you do get a guaranteed Stegoceratops, which you can sell for a couple of thousand uh, DNA. So, eh, it's up to you. We've also got the uh, these Mega S DNA packs. If you really want 160 of these, which I'm definitely not going to do. Good God. Um, and you've also got the solid gold premium packs, which do give you 7,500 DNA. And you've got way more of a chance. You've got a, you know, you've got three chances to get it. 25% each time. And then you get one of the rare solid gold packs. But of course, that's VIP points. Anyway, 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 we've got a lot more to check out. Because if we go into here, we've got the battle stage infinite. I have been stuck on this freaking battle for god knows how long because it is tough it's really tough and the, the opponents don't change so we've got a herbivore an amphibian and a carnivore which basically means i have to put in amphibians to guarantee that i don't ha i don't have anything that's good against me however the, they have so many thousands of attack it is redonkulous um if i just look at amphibians I die in one hit. And that's a level 40 Gorgasuchus. Cannot tank one hit. Um, nothing can withstand it. So you need to play this kind of carefully. Um, we need a tanky carnivore so that I can go for one reserve, knowing that he's going to switch into Metaposaurus and then I know I'm going to survive. It's only going to do 6,000 damage and I've got 18,000 health. Then, after that, I I might just keep on putting reserves on that. So then Metrophodon comes in, kills the Metaposaurus with as many reserves as it's got. Then, because they switched, Dino Kyrus will come in. At that point, I need a powerful carnivore like Indoraptor to kill it in two hits. And then, because Metrocanthosaurus uh, can't kill me in one hit, and I can kill it in two hits. It needs to be interrupted. That, as far as I'm aware, is the best team I can do. And once I've used it, well, I mean, I can get them back with my VIP thing. But apart from that, let's have a look. Let's have a look. The toughest battle I have ever faced. So we'll go, we'll do that. Pachygalosaurus is here to be a tank in order to give Metrophodon as many reserves as necessary. It's about 7,000. Yep, that's fine. That's fine. It is hot here, guys, man. Uh, in my office, I don't have AC. <laughs> so uh, I've got a fan blaring at me. And uh, that's it. I, I mean, I have an AC unit, but it's super loud. And even then, it doesn't really work. <laughs> it doesn't work that well because they need like a ventilation thing like, to ex get rid of the heat. And I don't really have that. And also, I can't... It's, it's horrible working at the moment in the Japanese summer is a nightmare. Okay, so that must have been all attacks. That must have been all attacks. I'm gonna guarantee I, I'll not factor in any extra because even if I get it, even if I hit it once, it's basically dead. Uh, so I'll go for that. I'll go for that. Yeah, here we go. I should really be paying attention to this because I can only do it once. <laughs> here we go. 13 freaking thousand. It has to go for three. It has four. So it'll go for three. You've been one block. There we go. Perfect. It's all going according to plan. 
Right, interrupted. This is it. You're the MVP here. You need to go for three attack. Um, so one, two kills it. Factor in the extra block that it might have. Now, if it didn't go for a block and it has, it went for a reserve. Metrocanthosaurus has five attack. He can't kill me in one. He's only got eight thousand. So I need four block, and I can go for one reserve. Unfortunately. I was hoping that it would have went for the reserve, but you, I'm, I'm playing it as cautiously as I can. Now, this is all up to luck. If he attacks, which he does! Yeah, there we go, beautiful. Yeah, and that's it, we're done, we're done. I finally did it! <laughs> it's taking me so long to kill this thing. Yes, oh my God, well, it was a super hard battle, but it gave me a super rare pack, as well as 100 DNA. Yep, there we go. And this is like guarantee of good DNA in these packs. So 1,250, 250 bucks, thank you. And another 1,250 and a Stegosaurus. But really, it's the VIP points. 650, yes. Next one, if I wanted to, is 288 bucks. And the thing is, though, they're gonna be... I mean, if I, if I got lucky and I got all of the books in the packs and I won it, I would technically have a profit of 12 bucks. <laughs> but I'm not gonna do that. Hell no. What we are gonna do is take on... Ooh, ooh, look at this. Hold up. There's a tournament going on right now for Othalmasaur? I don't even own Othalmasaur. What the frick? Oh, God. Oh, God. Wait, have I got it unlocked? Or did I sell it? Othalmasaur. Othalmasaur. I'm assuming it's a surface. Othalmasaur, where are you? Please. Okay. Okay, you're not a surface. Are you a reef? Okay. Othalmasaur. Oh, I have it. Okay. Okay, that's, that's fine. As long as I have it unlocked, that's the important part. Right. Okay, we don't need to worry about that. I wanted to do this challenge so this is a cavern which means that surface are going to be the best against it the plesiosuchus is there level 40 respectable for a tournament creature but remember tournament creatures you need them because there's a chance more than likely they will get a hybrid i don't even know if it has a hybrid i'm assuming not because i saw it max level and not hybrid um so dunkleosaurus is the better one i will put plesiosuchus in here here here, 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 here! But I kind of want Gorg Gorgon, Gorgonosaurus as well. Um, and then we'll we'll have a Hainosaur. Here we go. We'll see just how much. There it is. Can we do like a an evil voice? Do I? Yes, I am the Kraken. <laughs> Beautiful. Right, we'll speed this up as well, because this is going to be a long fight. Uh, I have loads of health. Look at that. Look at that. I also have 900 attack, which is also very good. Right. Really, it's all about just doing as much damage as I can to this thing. I can only do 1,600 to it at the moment. So... It's a bit tricky. They used to double the health every time. It was a double the attack. Maybe it was both. It might have been both. Oh, you bugger you. You cheeky git. All right. I'm going to go for that then. Oh, you blocked? <gasps> How dare. The audacity. Go on then. All right. Okay. Well, I'm going to factor in two. Oh. <laughs> hey, we win. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Uh Oh my god! It's alive! Right, 2,500 damage we can do to it now. It went for five! Okay, we're dead. Oh, we're alive! Never mind. <laughs> we're dead! We're alive! It's a roller coaster of emotion! Right. Oh, wait, he had blocks? Oh, didn't go for anything. Okay. Uh, one, two, one, two, and then four. May as well factor in two just in case. Ha ha ha! Yeah, yeah, it's dead! Whoa, it's alive! Oh no! I love messing around with my soundboard. It's loads of fun. Alright, I'm just gonna go for full reserve and just go for all our attack here. Oh my god, okay. It does not want to take any more damage. Ooh! 
That could kill me. Oh, it goes for it as well. Oh, no. There it is. Oh, I love the coloring of this thing. Yeah, the sort of whoosh of the speed lines. That looks awesome. Okay. Well, it went for all out attack. So we can go for that and just kill it. All right, let's see some of the attack animations from this thing. Yeah. It's just a chronosaur. <laughs> like Florodon. Look at this. Ooh, interesting. Okay, if you, if you don't speed up the battle, you get extra side effects. I like that. Oh my god, no! It knew it could kill me. What? No, go on, you Zoris. Right, Hainosaur comes in. Oh, they vanished. And it came back. Well, there we go. That's the best thing we can do. Just two hits. Wallop. Beautiful. Look, I can make a little thing. Die. Meow. <laughs> That's cool. I can point to things in the game. Look, okay, guys. Look at its health. It's so big. Okay, we're going to go. Oh, going to go down here. Right, it has four. We've got eight. So, I was going to say, does that count if I tap it? Oh, it does. That's amazing. Okay, we're going to factor in two. And then we're going to go reserves. <laughs> oh, perfect. Where's the lightning? Yeah, that's cool. I like that. I like that. What they should have done is have... Because they made these these creatures, like Kraken 18 and stuff. They gave them a theme. But they didn't give them any lore. It would have been cool if InGen had made them or something like that. I would have liked that. Alright, so I think he's got two block. But I'm going to go for two block myself. Yes, he did go for it. Okay, because I, I can die here. If he hit me with four, I'd be very, very dead. Now, this isn't the strongest creature I have. Dunkleosaurus is actually the strongest. That thing is a nuts. Right, okay. Kraken 18. Come on, then. Oh, it didn't go for it. Right. Kind of tempted now just to go for that. Hopefully it went for two block. It did go for two block, but then it's going to have six. So, ooh, I think it's going to be a easily kill me. But we're going to get over a thousand DNA for this fight alone. I know, I think it costs bucks. So, yeah, there are six. So, one, two, three... Yeah, I think four is just enough to kill me. So six, here it is. The death of Hainosaurus. No! I mean, really, if all you wanted to do was just grind this... Oh my god, it, it inked! No! Uh, if all you want to do is just grind this event, and you've got VIP, we could just buy back the Mos the Dunkleo Mosa, whatever it is. The Dunkleosaurus. So that's 200, so that's 500. That's 950. That's 1,600. Almost onto another 1,000. So we're going to do that one more time. We're going to put in... Do we put Dugliosaurus first? We'll put in the strongest team I could technically do. There you go. Mega Archelon. Should that be in the next video? Do just do loads of Lagoon episodes? Whoop. I feel like it's back in 2015. Multiple videos a day. <laughs> no, we'll save that. That'll be the next video. Dunkle Arklan will come back. I mean, this is only up for eight hours. But I do want to I do want to level up Dunkle Arklan. But you need to you need to have something to use them for. That's the problem. So we'll do this. Oh no, Mega Arklan. Everything should be Dunkle. Fuse Dunkle with everything. Oh, look at it there. Gorgeous. Uh we could almost hit, like take half its health off. And we're only level 20. Oh, it looks so cool. It's like a Megalodon with armor on it. Right, okay. I'm still just going to go for loads of reserves. Oh, it is too a powering up. It's like a Dragon Ball Z battle. Where we're just like... <laughs> doing that for a whole episode. Right, I'm going to go for that. I think you got two block. Aha! Nyah, headbutt. You think you could defeat me? my back, baby. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, I've got my thingies. Oh my god, the damage is... Oh, there we go. Big hit. But it survived. All right, one, two. I, I, maybe it had some extra reserve. No, it didn't. Oh, the tail slap from the Mega Archelon. Oh, you think you got me? Ha-ha! <laughs> I'm back. Again, this is going to get boring. It's not boring. We'll, we love it. We love seeing you do the same animation over and over again. Well, they should do. This is probably the only time that... Adding multiple different death animations to a creature makes sense. <laughs> and depending if it was a 
like a two, a four, a six, or an eight attack. Using different ones. Yeah, we'll do that again. Yeah, no, as it got to, oh, only one this time. Oh, stop hitting me, damn it. I'm only gonna come back, and this time even more stronger. Yeah, well, we know that. We know you are. Not to tell us. Right, seven attack. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, it's got two block. And now the glass cannon that is Tylosaur has loads more attack, but not more help. So one, two, one, two, and then we'll just go for two block here. Oh my God, it's gonna kill us. Tylosaur, no. Okay, okay, he's gonna have six and he can probably kill me in four. So he's gonna go for all his attacks. Yeah, yes, 100%. Yep, four is coming in. Oh, it could have been so... Oh, five! Oh, never mind. He didn't have to go for all his attacks to kill me. Here it is! Here he comes to save the day! I still kill it in one, actually. That's impressive. Okay. Oh, he didn't even go for the one block, damn it! Wabush! If only we, you know, I'd love if all the damage I would have inflicted that would have been this wasted counted towards the event, because then I could just save up and do an eight attack go boom you know just keep on doing that for a couple of rounds four four jesus okay was that all of his attack i think it might have been now i don't kill him in one i'm gonna make sure oh no well i made sure that i survived but i think i might be doomed here unless he goes for four. Oh yes unequivocally doomed you know what i'm just gonna risk the biscuit here risking the biscuit try to make sure the oh seven dems attacking numbers and oh here it comes no a seven attack is it gonna what is it is it spear what? oh and it killed me <laughs> it was so graphic we didn't even see the death <laughs> Fifty-five thousand. okay so that's good Oh, the legendary creatures, okay. And that's like 2,600. Whoo, 2,600. And it keeps on going. You could do 75 missions of the first one if you wanted to. And, I mean, we do have Get Dino. But how do I fuse? Oh, it tells you all the dinosaurs that are fusible. Oh, that's handy. I like that. Oh, that's so cool. All your super hybrids that are fusible. Oh, these are ones that are ready to be made. Right. And then what's this one? Oh, these are ones ready to be created. If, if we didn't want to just spend the super DNA to make it. Right? Because you can just buy them with super DNA. I'm pretty sure you don't need to fuse them. Huh. Interesting. But the, like these are ones that are saying it's ready to use the ingredients and the DNA. Because if I wanted to make a mono stegotops, let's have, let's have, now I'm curious. Mono stegotops, I've got a lot of you. There you are, go to. Now, if I wanted to make one, it's a thousand DNA. But if I go to this, get dino, go in here, it's 2000 mono. So it's still technically more expensive. It's double the price in super DNA. Not only that, it's also costing me a Stegoceratops. <laughs> Very interesting. But what I should do, I should get Mono Stegotops. I really should. We've already got a level 10. Uh, do I have one? Can I just bonk it? Three days. That'll do. I'm not, not really going to use anything. And I have this one, which only costs 10 if I wanted to. Uh, probably should have put in something a little bit cheaper in there. That's my bad. But let's have a look. We've got a smile of... Oh, smile of Ceres. That's actually a hype. Yeah, heck yeah. Right. Whatever. 12 hours. I'm not going to use it. I mean, we also have a 25 buck one as well. You know what? For 25 bucks, I'll do it. Um, what what can we make that might be good? Another Moses... A Moses at level 11. Or a Zalmoxes. Is there anything in here? Toro? Level, should we evolve? Yeah, plus the food. Right, so it does tell you the food it, it's going to require to get the next one ready to evolve. Ah. Well, we. you know what? Yeah, confirm. Let's use that. Let's spend that. Boom. Oh, the incubator is even different. 
Very nice. Okay, well, we'll collect those because we've done some of those battles. I don't think I have any of those missions to do. No, that's okay. Okay, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. It's, been, it's always a pleasure when I get to Jurassic World the game. I like it because I don't really have to edit too much and I can have fun knowing that I don't have to put in too much work afterwards. And also, we, we've been in this park for eight years. Eight? Next year, well, two in a year and a half's time, it'll be ten years we've played this game. Maybe less because it came out in 2014, technically, I think, or early 2015. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Oh, bye-bye.